Hey everyone, if you think that your basic concept in math are clear, then you should be able to add this. In case you don't know how to add two fractions, I'm going to explain you in this video how you can able to add any two fractions or more than two fractions. So this is a question. We have a 3 by 8 plus 1 by 2. Whenever you add a fraction, so you have to see that the denominators are same. In this case, we have 8 and 2 and they are not same. When the denominators are same, then we can able to add them. We have to just add the numerators. Now to make them same, I'm going to take the LCM of the denominator. Now here we have only two fractions. If there are more than two fractions, you have to do the same process. So let's find out the LCM of 8 and 2. We know that 8 and 2 are both multiple of 2. So we're going to take a 2 here. So 2 4s are 8 and then 2 1s are 2. Now since we have only 4 left, we can take just 4 1s are 4. Now multiply these two numbers. 2 4s are 8, right? So LCM of 8 and 2 is 8. Now here I'm going to make denominators 8. So I have to find out the equivalent fraction of these numbers to make a denominator 8. Okay, We have to find out the equivalent fraction of these numbers with the denominator 8. In the first fraction we already have a 8 in the denominator so we don't have to do anything in that. Let's do for 1 by 2. Now this 2 I have to change it to 8. So I have to find out the equivalent fraction of 1 by 2 where denominator is 8. And there are two ways we have to multiply here because we should get 8. So what number are going to give us 8 here? 4. So multiply 4 in the denominator and in the numerator. So 1 4 is a 4. So instead of taking 1 by 2, we are going to take 4 by 8 here because 4 by 8 is the equivalent fraction of 1 by 2. Now let's add them. So the first number is 3 by 8. You can see that already 8 is present so you don't have to change. In case it's not a LCM number, then you have to change the same way how we have done for 1 by 2. Now instead of 1 by 2, I'm going to take 4 by 8. Now see, denominators are same. We have to just add the numerators, keeping the denominators same, which is 8. Add the numerators, 3 plus 4, which is 7. So 7 by 8 will be the answer. It's very simple. You have to just change the denominator, find out the equivalent fraction, and then you have to just add them up. And 7 by 8 is the answer. We cannot reduce this further because 7 is a prime number. So it's a very simple one. I hope it's clear. If you have further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you.